It's not the type of art you'd find in any art gallery around town. A three-part project called Steam Song showcases a piece of Albuquerque history. The Rail Yards, News 13's Catherine Mazone found out from the coordinators and the artist exactly what that project entails and why they say it's a statement to the community. Catherine? That's right, Adam. It all started three years ago when an Albuquerque local and his artist friend from Berlin were visiting the rail yards. They say they were immediately struck by what they saw. The first time he showed me the place, and I have to say, I was blown away. I, it was so beautiful. The sun was there, the classes, the whole building, and it was empty. And I was really impressed. Hans Winkler is a world-renowned artist from Berlin. He was at the rail yards with local Lee Blaugren when the two decided they wanted the community to see what they see. Instead of a building with broken windows and graffiti, the pair wanted to showcase the place's architecture and rich history. Winkler began researching the rail yards, interviewing former workers and studying its history. Today, they'll premiere Steam Song, a three-part project. It includes four billboards featuring photos representing different viewpoints of the rail yards, brochures detailing the place's history, and Ghost Train, a recording of a steam engine set to play in the rail yard's blacksmith building. Now, Ghost Train will play repeatedly and randomly through a sound system in the building. It's set to last between four to six weeks. Back to you, Adam. Very interesting. And you could see the billboards for yourself in random places near the rail yards. The Ghost Train, part of the project, premieres today beginning at 11 at the rail yards.